Here's your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. Well, about a quarter of an inch of rain this morning, most of its southern suburbs and along the coastline. We need more, and while we do have a few showers in the forecast this week, unfortunately, I don't see a lot of widespread or heavy rain, certainly no big rain storms. Take a look outside on the western horizon one more time in Providence. Now the sun just starting to set in a few minutes, looking at the clear to partly cloudy skies right now, looking at the wind turbines and dry conditions after some of that wet weather earlier this morning. We'll keep things dry this evening and right on through the overnight after reaching around 66 67 degrees this afternoon it's cooled back down into the upper 50s to lower 60s currently 62 in providence will drop through the 50s to eventually upper 40s late tonight and early tomorrow morning satellite and radar composite is quiet some of the rain from this morning especially along the coastline is now well offshore high pressure is building in across the midwest and this will essentially keep things storm free and quiet over the next couple of days even though we've got a couple of chances for some showers is really not much. We'll show you that in more detail in just a second. Tropics remain very active, unfortunately. Uh, Gulf of Mexico, South Florida, Cuba, and of more concern here is now Tropical Storm Delta. Of course, we're in the Greek alphabet right now. What was once Tropical Storm Gamma has weakened to a depression. Delta getting stronger uh, rapidly right now. The winds are almost at hurricane strength. And the forecast track uh, taking it uh, through the Caribbean as a major hurricane and then into the Gulf of Mexico by the end of the week. It's been extremely active in the Gulf Coast this hurricane season. And it remains to be seen whether or not any of this remnant moisture can make it into New England by the end of the week and the weekend. So we'll keep you posted, but here we go again with another continental U.S. threat from a tropical system, again in the Gulf of Mexico. Closer to home this evening and overnight, just kind of cool and quiet. Temperatures dropping to the upper 40s to around 50 by around 5, 6 in the morning. It's more of a cloud-sun mixture tomorrow afternoon. This is 2 o'clock. It's really a comfortable day. Your temps are well into the 60s, upper 60s with a blend of clouds and sun. Slight chance of a sprinkle, but it's basically a mild and dry day. By this time tomorrow, Tomorrow evening, it's in the mid 60s, and then later tomorrow night, generally clear and temperatures in the upper 50s. So, the hour by hour breakdown uh, cool or chilly early in the morning, upper 40s, partly sunny skies, 11 a.m., 63, and about 68 degrees tomorrow afternoon. About a 20% chance of a brief sprinkle, if that, but basically a dry day, six, uh, 5 o'clock in the evening, down to 65. Bay forecast looks fine. Wind is a little brisk south of 10 to 20 knots, visibility unlimited. Your water temperature is still holding in the mid 60s. Seven-day forecast, not much in the way of widespread rain here on Wednesday, just a shower during the evening, much cooler Thursday and Friday, only to warm up again over the holiday weekend with a sunshine both Saturday and Sunday. Chance of showers on Monday, that's seven days out, so come back and check with us on the updates on that. All right, Tony, thanks.